In this video, I am going to cover how to download and install Snort on the Kali Linux 2.0 VM. I'm also going to explain how to edit the configuration file, create a custom rule, and use it to analyze a PCAP file with malicious traffic on it. For all the commands demonstrated in this video, look at the description below. Firstly, type apt-git install snort and press enter. When prompted, press Y to continue. Okay, so this is asking for the address range of your local network. Now, to find that, you can go to another terminal and type ifconfig. As you see for me, I have the, a net mask of 255.255.255.0. This translates in a CIDR notation as slash, forward slash 24. So we're going to go ahead and change that. The configuration to forward slash 24. To facilitate custom rule creation, type touch forward slash etc forward slash snort forward slash rules forward slash custom dot rules. This will create a rule file for our custom rules that we're going to create later. To change the default configuration of snort, type vi forward slash etc forward slash snort forward slash snort dot conf. This will allow you to make a variety of granular configuration changes. The only entry I'm going to make for the purpose of this demonstration is to include the custom.rules file we just created. So we'll type forward slash include dollar sign rule underscore path. This will bring us to the uh, rule inclusion page. So scroll down using page down, press I to go into insert mode, type include dollar sign rule underscore path forward slash custom dot rules. This is the name of the rules file we just created. Press escape on the keyboard colon WQ. That'll save and quit. Now you're ready to create and test snort rules of your own creation. Now we'll cover some basic snort commands. In order to run snort in network intrusion detection system mode or NIDS mode with the logging function, first create a location for your log files. Type mkdir log. This will create a directory named log. Next type snort hyphen l dot forward slash log hyphen b hyphen c etsy snort snort dot conf. This will compare live traffic to the rule sets based upon your configuration. To verify that your logs are populating properly, just check out your log file and make sure that it's being populated with the alert file. Type cd log to change to that directory. Type ls to display the contents of that directory. Looks like it's working. I'll go ahead and remove the contents of the log file. To demonstrate the creation of a snort rule, I'm going to make one which will fire alerts for a PCAP file containing neutrino exploit kit traffic. Type vi forward slash etsy, forward slash snort, forward slash rules, forward slash custom dot rules. First off, press I to enter into insert mode. Type alert, TCP, any, any, 
hyphen greater than symbol any any round bracket msg for the message that's going to be prompted possible neutrino exploit kit infection everything every statement must be have a uh, semicolon to separate them so content this is the data that will be searched for to uh, fire the alert double quote now we're going to enter a host name that's known for neutrino uh, exploit kit infection I'm going to paste it because it's a pretty obscure name and with a double quote semicolon now we're going to do a couple of uh, optional uh, statements here so the class type is Trojan activity which is the closest thing to this uh, type of traffic we have the SID and the revision this is uh, the first revision of this rule so revision one and close it off with the uh, round bracket now type escape on the keyboard colon wq this will save and quit to give a better understanding of snort rules i'll go over the snort rule we just made a bit this snort rule alerts tcp traffic coming from any ip and any port going to any IP in any port. It will prompt this message and it'll search for this string within the content of the tr network traffic. Class type will classify what type of alert it is. The SID is a unique identifier for snort rules and the revision uniquely identifies the revision of the snort rule. To analyze a PCAP file, type snort hyphen l dot forward slash log hyphen b hyphen c forward slash etsy forward slash snort forward slash snort dot conf hyphen r and the name of the pcap in my case it's malicious dot pcap type cd log ls we're going to make sure that the rule worked properly. So type cat alert pipe to less. Type forward slash neutrino. As you can see, the rule is working properly. Thanks for watching my video. Please thumbs up and subscribe.